Van lifers, overlanders, today I want to show you how I decided to build the battery system on my vehicle. At the moment I'm working on an overland truck so I can get to remote places around the world and the goal of this system is to give me some of grid capacity when I get to those places. The key components of the system are Renogy. I chose them because it's not too expensive and there is a good amount of users I can rely on for recommendations or advice. We have a 100 amps hour deep cycle lithium battery, 40 amps DC to DC charger with MPPT so that I can plug solar panels in the future and the battery monitor with the battery shunt. Manual isolator switch, 12-way fuse block, some ports so that I can put cigarette lighter ports, USB port. For the cabling from the starter batteries I decided to go with a 16 square millimeters cable. It's really thick, more than what's needed probably but I want to be safe and make sure it doesn't heat up with the charging. Inline fuses, 60 amps before the charger, 50 amps after the charger to the lithium battery. Main wiring will be built on a chopping board because it's plastic, so fully insulated and it's really cheap. This was three quid. Don't worry about it, I will explain it all. Let's get to it.